science. In this video, let's find the LCM and the GCF of 25 and 30. And I like to use a factor tree. Let's work on the LCM first. Okay, so let's complete a factor tree for 25. And that is 5 times 5. Circle both 5s because they are prime. And I'm down to prime numbers, so I'm finished. Next, let's look at 30. I can begin with 2 times 15. Circle the 2 because it is prime. And now 3 times 5 equals 15. They're both prime, and I'm down to prime numbers. I now create a prime number box or table to help prevent errors. So let's write the prime numbers for 25, and they are 5 and 5. And for 30, I'm going to start with the 5 because 25 has a 5. I don't have another 5, so I'm going to skip a space, and then I'm going to write the 3. Now, the LCM is the lowest common multiple, so it's the number that 25 and 30 will both divide into evenly, and it's the least number. So what I do is I multiply all these prime numbers together. However, I follow this rule. If I have a vertical pair, since we have two numbers, 25 and 30, I only use one number. So I'm going to, I have a vertical pair, so I'll bring down the 5, bring down the other 5, and then the 2 and the 3. Now I just multiply each of these numbers together and it will give me the LCM. 5 times 5 is 25, then times 2 is 50, 50 times 3 is 100. And 50. So again, I got the 150 from multiplying 5 times 5, which is 50, times 2, excuse me, 5 times 5 is 25, times 2 is 50, times 3 is 150. That's the LCM. Now let's focus on the GCF. Okay, now for the GCF. The GCF is the largest factor that will divide into both of these numbers evenly. So let's go ahead and create another prime number factor. So I'm going to write the 5s for 25. And I'm going to write the 5 again for the 30. Skip a space, 2 and the 3. Now, for the GCF, the rule is you only multiply numbers that are a vertical pair. Since we have two numbers, 25 and 30, you need a matching pair or two numbers. So we have 5 and 5, which is 1. There's not one here, not a pair here, not a pair here. So the greatest common factor of 25 and 30 is 5. I hope that helps in finding the LCM and GCF. And Moo Moo Math uploads a new math and science video every day. Please subscribe and share.